What is going on guys, your boy Joey Chicks MC coming to you guys with a video right now. So I want to talk about Joe Flacco. His press conference was today. Uh, I pretty much watched most of it, uh, but kind of want to go through and get some of the, you know, important things out of this press conference. We all know Joe Flacco is coming here. Um, and I don't know why, but they do this obviously because of the draft, but you know, they asked Joe Flacco, you know, what is he going to be on this roster starting quarterback backup? Are you, what's your role coming in? He's like, I'm just on the 53 man roster <laughs> and that's it. So I get really confused over stuff like that. Well, not confused, but you know, it's just like, is it really, I mean, they're really trying to keep it that big of a secret right now that there's that they can still draft the quarterback because he won't even say that he's going to be a backup with this team right now. And it's just, you know what I mean? It just gets annoying just hearing that. And it's just like, dude, come on. You know, after a certain point, you kind of just want to know the answer. They're still trying to put up smokes and, smoke and mirrors over this QB situation. I don't know why they're still trying to keep it a secret because of the draft, because they want teams to think they're still picking a quarterback at six. I have no idea, but it's just getting to that point now. It's like, come on, let's let's get it together here. Um, so what do you even say if he's going to be a backup starter? But they asked him about mentoring Jalen Hurts, and he pretty much, he didn't say directly yes, but he said um, that, you know, when you have a quarterback room, you know, you always want to help each other. So I guess... There will be some mentoring going on. There will be some talks going on. I mean, yeah, I mean, I would think so. I mean, I wouldn't think they're not going to speak to each other and they're going to sit in a room and just have their heads towards the other side of each other. You know what I mean? But I think there's a lot of good things to take from it. You know, is it a great signing? No. There are people out there that want to trade for Nick Foles, and I was probably pretty much one of them. But I didn't care whether Nick Foles was here or not, you know, all I really cared about was getting somebody in here. This way I feel more comfortable, not satisfied, but more comfortable that we don't draft a quarterback at six. I think that's what's really important here. Um, it's, been a, it's been a crazy ride this year. And, you know, I didn't know if we were going to get Tyrod Taylor or, you know, Jacoby Brissett or, you know, some of these other quarterbacks that we missed out on. Alex Smith was still out there, so I figured eh, maybe there's a chance to sign him. But now we go after a real, real veteran, you know, that's not, you know, I still think he could run an offense, but I don't think he'll take us anywhere. You know what I mean? So you get a guy that's good, you're paying him more money. You get you get a guy that's less skillful late in his career, just here as a, a nice brain to pick. I think that's where it's really important. And I people are still complaining that he's not good. If it was Nick Foles, it would... If it's Nick Foles signing here, it's, oh, Jalen Hurts' mind is he's going to, you know, Jalen Hurts messes up one game, they're going to throw him out, and, you know, the fans are going to want her, Nick Foles to come in. Then we sign, we sign Joe Flacco, and people are like, he's horrible, he's garbage. <laughs> oh, I don't know, you're paying him 3.5, you know, 7 million, you know, a little over 7 million incentives, but, you know, what do you expect to get a cheap quarterback like this? We're, I'm done paying backup quarterbacks a lot of money. I'm done with it. So other than that, guys, that's pretty much it. So I want to go over Joe Flacco on the mentoring aspect. And obviously the Eagles still have no idea. Still are not letting these guys talk about who's starting, who's not starting. It's kind of crazy at quarterback. Other than that, see you guys later. Check it up. Follow us. Peace out, guys. Peace.